one of the things that was always on my mind is that, you know, someday, you know, we need more choice in Edmonton, more television choice. So I said, well, 66, I'm going to go out and start uh, cable TV. You just knew that more would come with some choice. But, you know, to, to think back as to how that's progressed, to be a part of something that come from an idea, saw the first subscriber being hooked up, and now being one of the biggest companies in Canada in that business, it's a, it's a thrill just to be associated with it and be a part of it. But it's the people that need to have the credit. I just love it. I just love it and I love being in it. And that's why I still kind of keep pretty active even at my age. My dad was a farmer, you know, and uh, he, he didn't have very much. And so whatever he had on his death, he wanted to put it into a foundation. He established that I become the president and I'm still the president of it. I was very instrumental uh, working with uh, others in Edmonton to uh, raise enough money for the Stollery Children's Hospital and then for the Mazinkowski Alberta Heart Institute. We we're trying to raise money for this. And so we asked one of the parents to come in and tell their story. She had a, a little boy that had a hole in his heart. Now, I hope I, I hope I could tell this without getting emotional. So, um, the only option she had was go to Toronto. And she didn't want to go to Toronto. Then she heard about this Ivan Rebecca in Edmonton. So, their family went up to Edmonton and uh, Ivan operated on that and fixed the heart and so forth. So, she, her mother, and this little boy came to our boardroom here and uh, talk about a little hellion. He was just running all over and grandma's trying to catch him and so forth so he didn't run over a balcony or something. And this kid that used to sleep 20 hours a day now has just got full of life. And those are the kinds of things that make, it, make life important. You, you leave with yourself, you leave with your dignity, you leave with what you've done in life, you leave by the impressions you give to others and you know, you, you just can't, uh, can't lose that dignity. That's the last thing you lose.